adventurers enjoy a challenge. Why not try out the difficult version for this task? Do you think you can handle it? I have a really bad feeling about this. You can't see more than 10 meters ahead. We're navigating a cave that's basically made of rubble. That must be the place the Guardian wanted to lead me to. If you imagine Santorini as a circle, then this is its exact center. And if you're wrong? Then at least Nina's still pumped full of drugs and won't suffer so much through our otherwise agonizing deaths. Just keep driving and trust me. What the? That's it. The mouth must be the entrance to the Guardian's base. What makes you think that? It always is. Fine, but his mouth's closed. Oh, I'll just come up with something then, shall I? Would you mind holding off on the bickering until after the wedding? We need to concentrate on the task at hand. All right, let's take a look around. Maybe there's a key here somewhere. The submarine isn't making any headway against the current. We need to find a different route. The current is too strong. We'll have to try a different route. We should be able to shift the boulders with the claw. Will you look at that? A green crystal the size of a head buried under the rocks. We found another crystal. We found another crystal. We found another crystal. Wow! Nina, you were right. You shock me. <clears throat> Mr. Gruber, if you would. Take a look at this. I've seen work like this before, in Guatemala. And these columns look late Roman. Absolutely fantastic. 
This complex must be thousands of years old. Some of the pictures show guardians being tortured and burned. What happened? I see some kind of emergency escape capsule. The guardians seem to have become more cautious. Hmm. Do you think they work? <sighs> Since those two are occupied, it looks like I'll have to deal with the locked door myself. Let's see what this console's arrangement is. Egyptian hieroglyphs. I'm no expert, but maybe there's something particular about one of them. It seems like each symbol occurs a different number of times. Maybe that's somehow related to the solution of the puzzle. A depiction of the Indian god Ganesha. Beneath that is a row of symbols. Two of them seem to be missing. Hmm. It's an occidental relief. Probably from the Middle Ages. Exactly twelve figures each with a letter above their heads. Wait, not all of them. The final twelfth letter is missing. The door is now open. Please follow me. That's it. The deuterium. It's powering the whole facility. That little thing? That thing is pure energy. Yes, this will work. How? With the deuterium, we can finally start the machine. No. Some kind of force field. I can't get at it. We need to move on. We have to find the antimatter. <sighs> Max? What's wrong? Don't worry. He's not dead. Not yet, anyway. And don't worry about the antimatter, either. It's stored safely at CERN. So... so it was all a lie? The raid, the theft, it was all for show? You wouldn't have let us here voluntarily, would you? We need the deuterium. Without deuterium, our research would be in vain. I've injected your fiancé with a slow-acting poison. It is spreading through his body. He has perhaps 20, maybe 30 minutes at best. Bitch! You're wasting time. This is the antidote. If you can figure out how to deactivate the force field, you may have it. I don't have any choice. I better find a way to get the force field down. A number of people are depicted. Jesus! The kneeling man looks like... Max! And the person next to him? That could be me! And the one on the right, holding the pistol. Isn't that Cunningham? How weird. The themes seem to depict the past, present, and future. Pretty.
them? Is he still alive? What's going on? Where are you? Hurry up! Did you speak to me in my dreams? What did you want to tell me? Many years have passed since our last encounter. We have called to you in your dreams because we need your help. Uh -huh. Our brotherhood has existed for millennia. Our task is to protect humanity. Protect? From what? From itself. Our ancestors were still hunters and gatherers when the gods granted them deuterium, a source of nearly unlimited energy that bestowed great power upon them. In return for this gift, our ancestors had to swear a holy vow that they and their descendants would prevent mankind from exceeding a certain technological limit. How's that working out for you? During the Middle Ages, we were persecuted without mercy. We were brought to the brink of extinction. Then began what is known today as the modern era. An incredible explosion of knowledge and technology. It was only a matter of time before the computer would be invented and the hidden message in Pi discovered. What is it with this damn number? I told you of the Fermi Paradox. How could it be that there are no intelligent civilizations in the universe capable of intergalactic travel? It is because whenever a civilization anywhere in the universe advances to the point where it is capable of developing computers, it will inevitably discover the message hidden in Pi. And that civilization's curiosity will lead it to build the machine. And then what? What does the machine do? It destroys everything. The fire. Whoever created this message wanted to ensure that intelligent life would never expand exponentially through the universe and become a threat to others. Now you must ensure humanity does not follow this path. You must prevent this machine from being activated. As a sign of our trust, we will grant you access to this station's power supply. You will make the right decision. If I have to, I could deactivate the force field from this console. What am I to do? If I deactivate the force field, Cunningham will get the deuterium. She'll start the machine, and then what? The world will end, billions of lives will be snuffed out. I cannot permit that. Max, I love you. Please forgive me, but I cannot allow that. What is wrong with you? You prefer funerals to weddings? Go to hell. What are you waiting for? I've had a flash of intuition. I shouldn't help a nutcase like you destroy the world. Suit yourself. You've served your purpose. The power supply is deactivated. The deuterium, quickly! Shit. Cunningham has deactivated the force field. I have to get Max. Cunningham ran off with the deuterium, but that doesn't matter now. I have to take care of Max, the antidote. Cunningham dropped her bag. Let's see what's inside. Thank God, how are you? Dizzy, but breathing. What happened? Cunningham has the deuterium. She's probably escaped with the submarine. Damn. Now what? Do you remember the escape pods where we came in? Do you think they still work? I don't know. Let's go. Cross everything you've got. <laughs> 